Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to talk football with some of the biggest headlines from the past 24 hours. There's only one place to begin and that's with the Premier League and Chelsea have took another step closer to winning the title following a victory over Middlesbrough. The game finished 3-0 thanks to goals from Diego Costa, Marcus Alonso and Nemanja Matic. But this game also had big significance for the bottom of the table too as it now is mathematically impossible for Middlesbrough to get out of the relegation zone and will therefore be back in the championship for next season. As for Chelsea, they have extended their lead at the top of the table to 7 points over Tottenham and know that victory in their next game against West Brom on Friday night will confirm their status as Premier League champions. Sticking with Chelsea and their star midfielder N'Golo Kante has today won the Player Writers Association Player of the Year award. The player who joined Chelsea last summer from the Premier League champions Leicester City managed to fend off the likes of Deli Ali, Sergio Aguero and teammate Eden Hazard along with many other quality names to win the award. Elsewhere in League One, the playoff semi-final second leg of both games happened last night. Fleetwood were at home to Bradford looking to overturn a 1-0 deficit but the game ended up goalless meaning that Bradford are through to the final to be played at Wembley and their opponents are going to be Millwall who are through after defeating Scunthorpe 3-2 on the night as well as on aggregate as the first leg remained goalless. The final will be played in just under two weeks time. And now for a couple of transfer rumours. It's the time of the season again where we're starting to think about next year and there have been a couple of transfer rumours that have been flying around today and we begin with Southampton and in particular their star centre-back Virgil van Dijk. The defender has been in top form for the Saints prior to his season-ending injury and has been heavily linked with a move to Liverpool in particular as well as the likes of Chelsea and both Manchester clubs. But Southampton manager Claude Puel has today come out and said that Van Dijk isn't going anywhere and that you can expect to see him in a Southampton shirt for next season. Whether that actually happens or not remains to be seen. Also, Diego Costa is back amongst the transfer gossip as rumours of him moving to China will not go away. Tianjin Quanjian, I hope I pronounced that name right, are the team reportedly in talks with signing the Spanish striker, although various reports have also stated that a deal may already be in place or at least a deal is further along than we realise. Watch this space on that one. And finally, up in Scotland, Brendan Rodgers has won the PFA Scotland Manager of the Year award. The former Swansea City and Liverpool boss is on the verge of leading Celtic through an undefeated season with just three games to go. And those are some of the biggest headlines within the world of football from the past 24 hours. Guys, if you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you like what I'm attempting to do with the channel, then feel free to hit that subscribe button and also don't forget to comment down below i like to hear from you whether it's something that i have talked about or whether it's something that i've missed i'd love to hear from you guys your comments would be greatly appreciated and i will see you all in the next video